Hey everyone, welcome to the last Divide and Conquer solo lesson. In this lesson I'm gonna teach you how to play this part of the song. So, um, this section of the solo starts with um, F major arpeggio. Ah, well, that was bad. Right, so, slowly. Okay, after this we have um, D minor arpeggio starting from A. So, slowly. Alright, then we have an A minor arpeggio. Slowly. Again. And then we have a G major. Slowly. Again. Alright, then we repeat the um, F major uh, arpeggio as well, again. Then we repeat the um, D minor arpeggio as well. Let me do this slowly for you since there is a variation. Stop here on the A, so again. All right, and the next lick is just a very fast um, A minor scale, which goes like this. So, slowly. Thank you. 
light. Then the section afterwards starts with an F major arpeggio, which goes like this. Slowly. Then uh, D minor arpeggio. Slowly. Then we have an A minor arpeggio. <laughs> Slowly. And you notice that this is exactly the same thing that we played for the D minor arpeggio, just moves down to A. So again for the D, D minor arpeggio and then A minor arpeggio the same thing. Okay, so next up is um, G major arpeggio, which is exactly the same as, as the F major arpeggio we did at the beginning, but let me do it slowly for you. And then we do again um, F major, and D major, but this time we do a variation on it, it's gonna be like this, sorry, so slowly. And then the, the very last uh, note is um, A, and you would actually need um, a pitch pedal to bring it to the next octave, but I don't have one right now, so I'm just gonna do. So it's just A and then A the octave uh, higher. And that's the whole solo. Now let me play this last part um, again, slowly, so that you can follow along. So it goes like this.
Alright, now I'm gonna leave it up to you to learn the three parts in the three videos that I've published and glue them together. Have fun studying and rock on!